ashver.com. Hello and welcome to ashver.com. You are watching an interesting video on how to use Comfrey to heal broken bones. Comfrey to help heal broken bones. Traditionally comfrey was referred to as knit bone and was used as a poultice, and as a food, to encourage healing of broken bones and wounds. As part of our self-sufficient lifestyle living off the grid, I grow organic comfrey and a range of other medicinal herbs. As soon as my husband returned from hospital after surgery on his broken ankle, I began including fresh comfrey in his meals. I waited until the surgical stables were removed from his wounds before applying a comfrey poultice directly to his broken bones, but I didn't wait for long. Here's how I included comfrey in his recovery process. Two days after the staples were removed, I applied the first comfrey poultice. Because I grow my own organic comfrey, I knew there was no danger of chemical fertilizer or pesticides on the plant. It was a little disappointing that my husband broke his ankle in our winter when most of my comfrey plants had, had died back, but I had enough plants in sheltered positions, including a couple in large pots, to create the first poultice. Now that it's springtime I am making more. I pick the leaves, wash them in fresh rainwater, I live off the grid and carefully collect clean rainwater for drinking, and use the leaves immediately. Comfrey is available in processed form from a variety of outlets. Many people have used bottled products, but I always harvest from my own plants and use medicinal herbs fresh. This is just one in a series of hubs I've written about my husband's broken ankle. If you followed his story you'll know that I effectively reduced reduced his swelling using a natural product, allowing surgeons to operate within 24 hours of breaking his ankle. You'll also be aware he has been eating specific foods to help strengthen broken bones. Please note the dramatic difference between his leg looking like a piece of meat when the staples were taken out, and the second photo showing the smaller scar on his ankle, immediately after the comfrey poultice. We were particularly impressed by the healthy pink area where the staple marks are barely visible. Unfortunately it was winter and I didn't have enough comfrey on hand to wrap it thickly around his entire ankle. I wonder how good the results might have been if I... My husband says the comfrey is very soothing. After a week of spending all day every day on his feet, working and walking, he came home early today because his ankle was aching and he simply had to stop. It is only four and a half months since his accident and surgery, and he had been warned it could take a year, year or more before he would be back to normal. Within an hour of me applying the fresh comfrey poultice, he said the ache was gone. He left it on for most of the day. Today I also put some underneath his foot instead of just on his lower leg and ankle where the plates and screws were inserted to rejoin his bones, in case it might help. Of course he, fi he finds it impossible to remain seated for too long, and insisted in short walks around the house. He said walking with the poultice on felt like treading in porridge. Some governments have banned the use of comfrey tablets and capsules for medicinal use. Yet have no objection to comfrey being used as a food. If you study the debate you will learn that an adult human would need to eat over 19,000 comfrey leaves to ingest a comparable amount of comfrey given to baby rats in an experiment that resulted in liver damage. It saddens me when government authorities ignore hundreds of years of traditional healing and fail to adequately question research before deeming a natural remedy unsuitable for widespread use. Because we are never likely to eat 19,000 comfrey leaves in our lifetimes, let alone in a short period of time, we happily eat, eat comfrey as a food. It is one of the main foods we use for strengthening broken bones. I don't like buying tablets and capsules, and always prefer to grow my own organic produce. Fortunately comfrey is surprisingly easy to grow. Smile. Thank you for watching this interesting and informative video. This channel offers motivational, inspirational, valuable and informative videos to soothe, cleanse and inspire your health, mind, body and spirit. 
You can find lot of interesting videos on wide range of topics here. Stay tuned and keep watching.